Supportive tissues are classified into three categories. 1. Cartilage tissue. 2. Bone tissue. 3. Areolar tissue. Cartilage tissue. Cartilage tissues are present in nose, ear, larynx, trachea, and at bone joints. Cells in cartilage tissue are widely spaced. The space around cells is solid and is filled with protein and sugars. Cartilage tissue smoothens the joint area of bones. Smoothness helps in movement of bones on one another. Cartilage tissues also provide stability and support to surrounding tissues and bones. Cartilage tissue help in maintaining the shape of organs. Because of cartilage tissue, ear and nose stay in same shape. Bone tissue. Bone is made of layers of hard and soft materials. Outer part of bone is hard whereas inner part is spongy. In addition to hard and spongy parts, bones have bone marrow and periosteum. Bone marrow is innermost part of bone, whereas periosteum covers the bone from outside. Part of bone between marrow and periosteum is made of bone tissues. Bone tissues contain minerals such as calcium and phosphorus. Our skeleton system is made of bone tissues which provide structure and stability to body. Ligament is also considered as bone tissues as it connects two bones together. Ligaments are elastic in nature and has less space between its cells compared to other supportive tissues. Areolar tissue. Areolar tissues connect outer skin to muscles. These tissues are also found around organs, blood vessels, and nerves. It connects them to muscles. Areolar tissue provides strength and support to organs in our body. This tissue is elastic in nature and enables relative motion between organs. It also helps in repairing surrounding tissues. 